the stock horn? Yeah. <laughs> that sounds hilarious. I know. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, car friends? Not what you'd expect, no, right? this, this is Stu from Willy Cool Videos, <laughs> and this is Darcy. Hey, guys. It's <laughs> so nice to meet you. Thank you for bringing your car on the channel. Our first girl. We got a lady driven car on the channel. And what an awesome car it is. Subaru BRZ with the, what body kit is this? It's the V3 Rocket Bunny kit. Nice, a real one, right? Yeah. All right. And then these wheels are amazing. What are those? What are those? They're work VSXs. I just got those. It took like four months to get because they were custom ordered, so. Nice, what are the specs on them? The front is 18 by 10, negative 22, and the rear is 18 by 13, negative 17. Crazy. 13s. Yeah. Those are the same size wheels that were on the RWD Porsche that I drove a couple weeks ago. So that's that's some big wheels. You gotta go big, right? <laughs> go big or go home. It feels great. It feels great. I just drove my buddy's girlfriend's stock Scion FRS last night. So I can compare and contrast the difference between a stock one and one with wide wheels, coils, and uh, intake and exhaust, right? Yeah. And the smallest little motorcycle mirrors <laughs> I've I know. ever seen. They're so hard to see out of when we pull up to like car shows or meets. I have to have everybody guide me because right. I'm like, I'm just going to hit everybody's car <laughs> totally for looks, not for use. Well, that's right. And your dash is signed by Mr. Rocket Bunny, right? Yeah, Kimira. He's the one that designs all the Rocket Bunny kits. So he came out from Japan a couple months ago and we all did a cruise all the rocket bunny kits nice so he came out and signed everybody's cars that was cool that is really cool and they do look great it takes a car that looks good and makes it look like drop dead gorgeous this thing certainly has presence yeah when we hit a thousand subscribers Jake's gonna jump his truck because he has a pre-runner over this car so what? Got, yeah are you gonna do it yeah we have to. <laughs> you guys silly I'm still gonna send it that's gonna be awesome okay so make sure you check out her YouTube channel <laughs> to see her boyfriend jump <laughs> the BRZ wow that, that's a crazy <laughs> idea <laughs> okay but they're doing it you heard it. there you go so how much does a rocket bunny kit cost well I bought the rocket bunny kit without the wings because it comes with two wings this kit in particular okay. um it was 3500 well 3550 actually nice for the fenders and the bumpers and all the canards and then i just bought the wing off of my friend who also has the kit so it's it is an authentic v3 rocket bunny wing but it's not the gt wing you said you bought the car used i did i bought it from actually another girl and nice. it was i paid 20 grand for it I was checking Auto Trader. They go for about 15 to 20, depending on, you know, spec and miles and stuff. Yeah. So for about 20, 25 to have a fully kind of <laughs> kitted car that looks amazing. Yeah, and the well. wheels themselves were like. Yeah. Uh, Those are baller wheels. They were almost three grand, yeah. so. <laughs> what you get what you pay for. Yeah. Those things are forged, right? Yeah. 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 It's interesting that the cars don't have more power. 
it's funny, and that's what everybody talks about, but if they just had, like, either 50 more torque or 50 more horsepower, like, yeah. either or, but I feel like if it did, you know, people wouldn't mod them as much. Like, it almost, they created a car that was, like, awesome, but mm -hmm. just needed a little bit more. Yeah. And they created, like, this huge tuner and aftermarket scene around these two cars. Yeah, that is a good point. Uh, I mean, I was gonna do some type of force induction. I wasn't sure if I was gonna supercharge or turbo it, but now that I got into drifting, it was go, like... Right. Right. It's funny, the thing that I like least about the car is the engine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, you know, you can always do a swap, you can always tune it more, um, do an E85 tune or something like that, and yeah. give it a little bit more power. Have you thought about doing any tunes or stuff like that? Um, I thought about it and I was getting close to it, and then, like I said, I yeah. bought the drift car, right. so and I kind of... And now all your money's into that. Yep. And your YouTube <laughs> channel, probably. Yeah. <laughs> You're buying cameras and such, like it, like it. Master Flow Center. <laughs> okay, almost stopped. That's okay. Shh, we'll edit that out. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Darcy, thank you so much for driving down. It was so nice to meet you. Really appreciate it. Guys, please drop a thumbs up if you like what you saw. Check out her channel for sure. Please subscribe to mine as well. I do have more lady driven cars scheduled out and ready to go. So, uh, browse the channel and see what else you like. And uh, drop a thumbs up. Comment below. What, let me know what you think of this car. And uh, until next time, have a really cool day. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> this is the life of a drifter, apparently. <laughs>